Hello friends, welcome to The Smoke Report. I'm your host, Jay Todd, and I gotta admit, I'm excited about this week's show. I've got a product review of this bad boy right here, plus a story I should have covered on our last program about a major tobacco company purchasing a major e-cigarette company. All of that in the second half of this video, because right now, I am going to do what I love to do most. Tear someone a new ass. In a story this week on Time Healthland, a new study finds that graphic pictures on packs of smokes stick in your mind better than the traditional printed warning labels. Now, I don't know what's more stupid about this story, the fact that Time thought it was newsworthy, or that money was spent to conduct the survey in the first place. Graphic images stick in your head better than words? Really? Who conducted this study? The Institute of Duh? The point is really lost on these people. Graphic ads are more memorable because they are also more insulting. We get it. Smokers understand smoking is dangerous. Smokers have been banned from public places. They have to pay higher insurance premiums. They have basic freedoms denied them in their own homes and in their own vehicles in some instances. They are treated like lepers in society. And now they're being patronized like ignorant children and shown grotesque pictures as a last ditch effort to manipulate their behavior through scare tactics. Hey, uh, I got an idea. Let's pass a law against staring at the sun or running with scissors. Those are dangerous. Nanny state idiots. Welcome back to the Smoke Report. Can you, can you see me through there? All right, there you are. <clears throat> Before I cover our last story on this program, I wanted to thank the good folk over at Cuban Crafters for sending me this La Carolina cigar. Mellow, with a nice draw, obviously. Very pleasant aroma. It's got uh, pure Cuban seed tobacco. Yeah. It's the number one medium-bodied cigar in the United States. For more information, or to order some for your collection, visit cubancrafters.com. Thanks again, guys. Oh, and when you're over there, tell them J. Todd sent ya. Finally, I wanted to let you all know that industry-leading Blue E-Cigs has been purchased by Lorillard Inc., parent company of Newport Cigarettes. Blue e-cig customer reaction has not been positive, with many fearing that tobacco companies are now going to start getting involved with e-cigarette products, fears that may well be justified. But my friends, who knows? Perhaps Newport just looked down the road and they saw a bleak future in their business, what with taxes and graphic warning labels and God knows what other witch hunts are on the way. Perhaps this is just a proactive move to secure a place for their company in an ever-changing market. Time will tell. 
Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all on the next edition of The Smoke Report. You're